Right now, we do want to get to our GMA cover story, Vogue, facing criticism for the cover of their latest issue featuring Vice President-elect Kamala Harris. Janae Norman joins us with more on why the fashion magazine is getting some backlash over the styling and more. Good morning, Janae. Hey, Amy, good morning. When you think of Vogue magazine, you think high fashion, top-notch styling, and luxury designer. So many were shocked to see the cover with the VP elect, with the general consensus being that the magazine just missed the mark. Over the weekend, the cover of the February issue of Vogue featuring the vice president-elect leaked. Kamala Harris casually wearing her signature chucks with the pink and green backdrop, a nod to her Alpha Kappa Alpha sorority colors. The cover's unplanned early release immediately drawing criticism for not measuring up to what's expected from the leading fashion magazine. One person writing, they really put Kamala Harris VP in Converse for Vogue, slamming the photo for looking like an amateur snapshot, even though it was shot by accomplished photographer Tyler Mitchell, a person with direct knowledge of the negotiations, telling ABC News that Harris's team believed a different image shot by the same photographer would cover the print edition, one featuring Harris in a blue power suit with a subtle gold backdrop. ABC learning that Harris's team chose both outfits. The fashion magazine telling ABC News the team at Vogue felt the more informal image captured Vice President-elect Harris's authentic, approachable nature, which we feel is one of the hallmarks of the Biden-Harris administration. To respond to the seriousness of this moment in history and the role she has to play leading our country forward, we're celebrating both images of her as covers digitally. Along with the two portraits, readers got a closer glimpse into the former California senator's private life with a never-before-seen picture of Harris on her wedding day with husband Doug Imhoff and anecdotes of how the pair spend their time from listening to old-school hip-hop, real old-school jazz, the classics like Prince and Stevie Wonder during their morning power walks, to Harris giving her husband a lesson or two in the kitchen. The soon-to-be second gentleman admitting he's typically not a cook, saying he once tried to grill burgers and steak inside their apartment. Harris had to fan away the smoke with her briefing binder. And that photo with the powder blue suit was overwhelmingly preferred to the casual Converse shot. But still, despite the criticism, so many comments were happy to see the magazine celebrating the first woman elected to become vice president. Robin. I love how you said wearing her chucks, her, her <laughs> Chuck Taylors like that. But, you know, I, I agree with what you said that they, I understand what they were going for, but just didn't hit the mark. Right. All right. And, and that's what many people felt that they just missed the mark. That's it. All right, Janae, thanks so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.